Hi Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So as you can see from the title of this video, this one's all about some practical advice. Nothing mind-blowing, just some simple advice about restarting and booting up your PC. Now as many of you may know, when you first launch any app or web browser after you restart or boot up your PC, maybe as an example, that first boot, boot up of your PC and start up of your PC first thing in the morning. Um, that app or web browser is going to load a lot slower um, especially if your computer um, still has an older mechanical hard drive and not an SSD solid state drive. Now, the reason for this, um, as you may know, be is because on the first um, boot up or s launch of your PC, as an example, first thing in the morning, your operating system um, is basically loading everything it needs off the actual drive, which means that drive has to locate and load files for Windows and every app that is loading on startup. So, um, as I have posted uh, in a previous video regarding startup apps and configuring startup apps, which I'll leave a link to in the description, if we just head over to our startup apps, um, depending on how you have your startup apps configured, any app here that's turned on will load to some extent or the other in the background when you um, boot up your PC. So there's a lot going on after the first couple of minutes after you boot up your PC. And um, that means that the drive, especially if it is a mechanical drive, um, is very busy after a boot up of your PC, as you may know. Now, getting back to the title of this video. Now, what I have seen in regards to this is, um, especially in work situations where someone boots up their PC first thing in the morning, as an example, um, they will head to their web browser, they'll click on that. Then they'll head to an app, they'll click on that. And then that app or web browser doesn't launch in a second or two. So they'll go back and re-click on the web browser and go back and re-click on the app now what's happening um, is things are loading twice. So now things are going to take twice as long to open. So you're actually kind of defeating the purpose of the whole exercise. That's why I'm saying wait. So what you need to do, it might, might sound counterproductive, but especially if you are using an older mechanical hard drive, just give your computer two to three minutes just to boot up. So it can load everything off the drive into memory, everything it needs to boot up properly, all your startup apps, and all the processes in the background. And as mentioned, it may sound counterproductive, but it's actually going to make things a lot quicker for you at the end of the day. Because once things are loaded into RAM, they are much faster than, as an example, um, loading from a hard drive or especially a mechanical hard drive. So as an example, um, when I first launch my web browser first thing in the morning when my PC is booting up, it'll take a lot longer as mentioned. But now if I've opened and closed that web browser throughout the course of the day, it's going to take, sorry, it's going to be a lot quicker opening than it will first thing in the morning because now it's loaded into RAM, which means it's a lot quicker because RAM is faster than a hard drive. And uh, um, that's why I'm just saying to you, wait. Um, might sound counterproductive, but just wait, especially if you are using an older mechanical hard drive. Now, um, just some practical tips if you don't want to wait. Obviously, upgrading your um, boot drive. So that's your actual drive your operating system boots boots from so that would be the c drive for um for most users your c drive for most users um would be your a boot drive so upgrading your boot drive from a mechanical hard drive to an ssd um basically is the best thing you can do for your pc when it comes to increasing the speed and the performance of your pc i actually upgraded this laptop's um mechanical hard drive to an ssd a couple of months ago and the speed difference uh, is incredible so if you can afford it and you can upgrade to an ssd and obviously adding more ram um, memory uh, is the next thing you can do just add more ram and um, because obviously if you get an ssd and you're only running four gigs of ram there could be a bottleneck so try and get a little bit more memory um, if you do upgrade if you can afford it to an ssd but nonetheless as mentioned the best thing you can do and when loading up your PC and booting up your PC is just to wait. Give it a two to three minutes wait and um, things will then boot and load a lot faster when you are trying to launch apps and web browsers. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.